Hi, how are you doing? I might remind people that well over a year ago, I reported on this disgusting little excuse for a camera, which actually isn't a camera, it's a butt wart that attaches to an iPhone. It's called the DX01. It uh, combines four images into one, and the company that produced it was DXO Mark. But they off spun that part of their company as a separate company, DXO Labs, uh, to uh, produce you know some software and uh, that horrible little abysmal excuse for a camera. And I reviewed it, and uh, what was more disgusting than the camera was the fact that this company is known for accurately uh, testing cameras and testing lenses. They uh, they made a really unethical evaluation of their own camera. Oh my god, how shocking is that? They actually skewed uh, the testing of their own camera because they actually said that it rated higher than an Nikon D7200, a real camera. But it's not. It's an HDR camera. It combines multiple images. And it's really slow, and there have been other people testing the camera, and I picked it up. It's just like the most laughable excuse imaginable. And I said at the time, I said, whoever made this, and I know who made it, at the time it was DxO Mark, um, which is now DxO Lab. They're in bankruptcy. Yes. Can of Rumors picked up that information. Petapixel picked it up today. Um, so DxO Mark, the camera and lens rating people, which I have absolutely, I have, I have less than zero credibility in. I have no, no love for them whatsoever. They off-spun that company, DxO Labs, which is now in bankruptcy. I said that over a year ago. I said, whoever made this camera, which isn't a camera, that they're going to be in trouble because it's going to drag them down like a lead boat anchor. I've got, I had no respect for DxO Mark then. I have no respect for DxO Mark now. Um, yeah. I accurately predicted it first, and there we go. Boom.